Hi, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this particular video, we'll see how to fix the peacock app not working on Roku. So let's get started. The fix number one, check your internet connection. Ensure your router is turned on and functioning properly. Check the power cord and ensure it's securely plugged in. Go to your router settings page. Usually by typing the router's IP address in the web browser, verify your network is active and connected. Okay. The fix number two is restart the Roku device. Ensure that the Roku device is properly turned off by pressing the power button on the remote control. Wait for some 30 seconds to allow the device to fully shut off. Press the power button again to turn the Roku back on. Fix number three is update the Roku app. That is the Peacock app. Go to the Peacock app on your Roku. Press the star button on the Roku remote. Select check for the updates from the options menu. If then update is available, follow the prompts to download and install it. Fix number four is check for the Roku TV firmware updates. Press the home button on your Roku remote. If the system menu in the system menu, select the system update. If an update is available, select update now. Your Roku TV will restart after the update is complete. Fix number five is uninstall or reinstall the Peacock app. Uninstalling the Peacock app, go to the settings app on your device. In the settings menu, select the app. If necessary, select see all apps and select Peacock. Tap uninstall to remove the Peacock app from your device. Reinstalling the Peacock TV app, go to the app store on your device. Search for the Peacock in the app store. Download and install the Peacock app from the app store. Sign into the Peacock account using your login credentials. Fix number six is contact the Peacock support team. If you have tried all other troubleshooting methods and if you're still facing the problem, you can contact the Peacock support team through the website peacocktv.com slash unavailable. So once you visit this website, you can contact them through the phone number or you can, call, you can send a message to them, the technical expertise team. They will be able to assist you and give you the solution. Okay. So that's all about this particular video guys i hope you like this particular video please do subscribe to the youtube channel see you and all thank you bye bye